It's the break of dawn and this team of rangers, vets and some locals are gearing up for an important rescue mission. They have to move one of the seven Rothschild giraffes stranded on the other side of Logichora Island at Lake Baringo. They have a two-hour boat ride to the island before their mission can begin. The rangers know all seven giraffes by name. They are six females, Asiwa, Susan, Pasaka, Nkarikoni, Nalangu, Nasieku, and Labrenoti, the only male in the bunch. The giraffes are stranded on the island which is slowly being drowned by the rising levels at Lake Baringo. Rising of high water levels in the Rift Valley lakes and Lake Baringo was not exceptional. Uh, this lake has increased uh, for about 88.6% uh, uh, from 176 kilometers squared in 2010 to approximately 278 or 76 there kilometers squared. We follow instructions here ya Tanui. Wakati wa ku direct what to uh, directing people who are controlling the rope. The first giraffe to be moved is Asiwa, who's been separated on another part of the island due to the rising water levels. The task at hand is demanding. They gather one last time before they embark on the grueling task ahead. Two of the rangers make their way into the thicket now submerged by the lake waters. They are searching for Asiwa. They spot the giraffe and they immediately start strategizing on how to move her. The vet is alerted and starts readying the tranquilizer. The delicate task of getting the right dosage for the gentle giant now lies in his hands. One wrong calculation could prove fatal. The tranquilizer gun is loaded with a dart and the vet makes his way to the right position. One shot hits a siwa. The tranquilizer works quickly and the team rushes to lasso and blindfold a siwa. In capturing the giraffe, of course, you have to, uh, we try a number of, a combination of methods. We have to dart with drugs and then we have to rope it and guide it to, to the boat. The boat, the boat is custom made. It's not um, the badge that we use to transport it. It's not the normal thing, you have to custom made it to accommodate the giraffe. Once the giraffe is safely inside the transportation vessel, it is tugged and guided by a number of boats all keeping a close eye in case of any emergencies. The journey to the mainland is a long but worthwhile endeavor. The boat docks and the team of rangers and locals work together to get Asiwa out onto the mainland. She trots towards the bushes into her new home. Six more giraffes now wait to be rescued. But for now, the rescue team have a good reason to celebrate. Yeah.